Bible His Stories. Ah, bonjour, gentlemen. Uh, my name is Baron de Coubertin. Ah, bonjour, monsieur. Ça va? Ah, vous parlez français? No. Don't ever do that. Okay, so I would very much like to pitch the story of the first Olympic Games. Ah, Greece, the Acropolis. Clash of the Titans, this could be interesting. Take some blood, Greece is hot. Apologies, gentlemen, uh, I think there is some confusion. Uh, I don't want to pitch the story of the ancient Greece Olympics. Whatever, so long as you're wearing togas. No, no, there won't be any togas. It is not the Olympics from thousands of years ago. Uh, the Games I started is the modern Olympics from 1896. Is anyone else here, like, really confused? <laughs> Always. I think I get it. Uh, you created the modern Olympics. Yes! The first Olympic Games since the original ancient Greek ones. Well, no, because I have a friend, uh, William Penny Brooks. He created an Olympics in 1850 in the small Shropshire village of Much Wenlock. Uh, it is what I based my Olympics on. So what you set up was the third version of the Olympic Games? Well, I... Well, no, because I think there is another one, uh, the Cotswold Olympics in the early 1600s. But, you know, it was more traditional, quirky English games, not a serious sporting event. Okay, quirky, English, I'm thinking Hugh Grant. Hugh Grant! So what you're trying to pitch here is the unique story of the founding of the fourth, different version of the Olympic Games. Olympics 4, the disappointment. Please, my Olympics, it changed the world. It shows what mankind can achieve if he is pushed to his limits. Think of uh, Usain Bolt. Bolt, I love that movie. Is there a cartoon dog in this story? No, it is a serious sporting event, huh? Winning an Olympic gold medal is one of the highest achievements you can make. I know, because in the 1912 Olympics, I win one, huh? Look at this plane! Impressive. And for what particular sporting event did you win that? Literature. Okay, I think we're done here. On your marks, get set, get out. Au reservoir. Nice guy. Mm. Horrible history.